you see in uh, the top team in terms of sacks in the NFL? What have you seen from them on film that stands out? Yeah, I would say that they just have a lot of good individual players, um, guys that can win their one-on-one -on -one matchups. They run their twist really good. Um, they've got a lot of uh, chemistry going up front with it. Um, that's that's what that's what allowed them to get to the quarterback this year. You know, does that make it more difficult when they have that many guys? I think they have eight guys with three or more sacks. Yeah. And so now I guess you don't necessarily know where it's coming from. Yeah. All these guys obviously are capable of rushing. Yeah, I mean, it just makes it where you can't key in on one guy. You know, we've played the Khalil Max, the J.J. Watts, where you kind of keyed in on that player. Um, but with teams like this, you have to really win your one-on-one -on -one individual matchups um, to win the game. No, no. How critical does that make it to run the football? Because they don't allow a lot in the passing game. I think 233 yards, they've got 12 picks. Uh, they get to the quarterback. Uh, but you guys like to control the clock and run the ball anyway. Yep, yep. Uh, I mean, that's something we go into every game thinking that we want to do is run the football. Um, we just have to go out and execute the plan. I know that sounds like a, a broken record, uh, but that's what we have to do is go out and execute our plan. Where's the chemistry at right now on the offensive line? It seems like every week you guys get some new news. Now with Easton, what have you mm -hmm. looked for mm -hmm. that's been impressive over the last weekend? Yeah, I would say that chemistry's chemistry's right there. You know, Nick came in. Um, he's prepared like a pro, of course, um, and he's just been waiting on his moment. Uh, so I'd say chemistry's doing pretty good. You know, you've seen a lot of that with this team this year. Is is that especially, I guess? Impressive. I mean, obviously, you come from college, but you've seen guys, you know, whether it be Alvin out for a couple of weeks mm -hmm. or Marshawn out or, you know, Drew out or now yeah. um, Andrews out. Is that yeah. particularly impressive to see how these guys just step in and, and the train keeps moving? Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's it's really like a next man up mentality. Um, that's the thing about being here is your backup is almost equally as good as your starter. Um, and it, it helps. It helps a lot.